changing lane conditions and bowling, you're bowling against an invisible playing field. Something like golf, where you're playing on a green, and bowling, you're playing on a lane that has some kind of oil pattern on it. Not only do you have to adjust yourself properly, but there's many other attributes to the lane that you have to know about. There's techniques and methods to combat those lane conditions. Be it a certain ball, a certain angle, certain rotation, certain speed, and also a certain approach. You can change your steps, you can change your ball, you can change the surface of the ball. There's many things that you can do to adjust the lane conditions. You gotta make sure you have the proper technique and a proper method in order to score. Some of the different lane conditions you have is a regular house pattern that's generally between 36 and 38 feet and the oil is very light and it's easy to score. On a competitive side you have sport conditions or heavier concentration of oil in the middle of the lane and on the outsides to make it more difficult to score as more of a challenge. To see what kind of pattern you have on a lane or what oil conditions you have in front of you, you need to throw a couple of practice shots to make sure you know what's out there and to read the lane by watching the ball pattern down the lane. If your ball ends up going too quickly down the lane and has very little hook, you most likely have a lot of oil concentration on the lane. If the ball ends up being a little more aggressive and starts hooking a little earlier, it's going to definitely tell you that the lanes are drier or with a shorter pattern. If you come across a lane that has too much oil or more than you're used to, there's certain ways of combat that condition. You can actually change your ball, change the surface of the ball. You can adjust yourself physically on the approach by creating less or more angle. And also ball speed. You can throw a little stronger or throw a little slower. On the other end of that, when the lanes are drier and the ball is hooking too much or has too much movement, you're going to change the ball surface or change the ball itself. Maybe have a little more speed on the ball to get the ball down the lane and create a different angle of entry to combat that certain condition. When you're bowling in the league, you may not have a too much of a change of conditions, but when you go someplace else with a different bowling center, you may have a different shot to play on. So you have to make sure you throw some practice shots and read what the, what the ball is doing in order to change balls or make the proper adjustment for that condition. Mm -hmm.